Hi, I'm Marty Nemco. This is another of my short short stories from the book I've just started to work on called Light uh, as a companion volume to the just published book of mine called Dark. Uh, this short short story is called A 50-Year Secretary, Oops, Admin. I think the administration assigned Helen to me because we both are in a wheelchair, but we ended up compatible in more important ways. Her strengths compensate for my weaknesses. While I'm good at coming up with ideas, I can be disorganized. She's a bit of a neat freak. I'm enthusiastic, but that occasionally devolves into anger, while Helen is steady. I'm serious to a fault, and she's more moderate. Glaciers move faster than universities, but the two of us have seen lots of trivial changes that the university considers major, and that we laugh at. When we started, we were Southwest Kansas College. Then, although nothing much had changed, they changed the name to Southwest Kansas State University. I guess it sounded better to prospective students and to donors. And recently they changed it to John F. Kennedy State University. Now that uh, the university has a marketing department, which of course they call external relations, I'm guessing that the marketing people found that JFK State U polls better. Then there was the time that the administration sent all faculty and staff a memo ordering the faculty to, quote, henceforth review to the people who used to be called secretaries as administrative assistants. Helen's reaction? Don't administrators have anything better to do with their time and students and taxpayers' money than that? I love Helen. Then there was a time they paraded us into a diversity, equity, and inclusion meeting. I should say they rolled us in. We felt like zoo animals. We couldn't wait to escape, and we left work early and went out for a drink. On a more substantive note, as we've gotten older, I'm more forgetful. She's doing better and is always tactful about it. Oh, we all forget things. Helen had been my secretary, oops, my admin, for 49 years, and we had agreed that we would retire together when we reached 50 years. Unfortunately, administration didn't care about that. Four years before the 50-year mark, I received a notice that because my grants had dwindled, the university would no longer support both Helen and me. I offered to be the one who retired, but Helen refused. She offered to retire, and I refused. So we decided that the number was meaningless, and happily, we rolled out together. In any event, that story is called A 50-Year Secretary Oops Admin. As usual, I welcome your thumbs up and accept your thumbs down. I always look forward to your comments and especially like it if you hit the share button below. Share on your social media so that my efforts can have broader impact. And I am flattered if you choose to subscribe to my channel. In any event, um, yeah, you might also want to check out my two books of short, short stories that are currently available on Amazon. One is called Soloists, Stories of Introverts and Outsiders Facing a Dilemma. And the just published new one is called Dark, Stories About What We Whisper About. And in any event, I do thank you for watching. I am Marty Nemco.